Hi everybody, Gordon Firemark here with another question and answer for the Business of Show Institute. Donna asks, Dear Mr. Firemark, my question relates to a past newsletter article about a lawyer or manager submitting one screenplay to a production office for a fee. What is your advice if I offer a contact, an advocate of my work, a finder's fee if his submission or contact of my work brings me to the sale of my script? I was told 5% is fair. Or is that a no, too, as related to your advice? Well, no, Donna, I wouldn't say it's a no. 5% is a reasonable and fair fee. In fact, that's what most lawyers that do handle submissions charge. Um, the, uh, the issues are, are, are several, though. One is that um, engaging in the practice of selling screenplays, pitching them, going around, taking them to uh, submissions, and so on, may implicate the uh, California Talent Agencies Act. If you're located in California and they, the person... Uh, goes around and sells your script, that may be construed as procuring employment, which in California requires a license as a talent agency. Now, if the person isn't licensed as a talent agent, that doesn't mean you can't make the sale uh, go through. It just may mean that that, uh, that person's legal position may be in jeopardy um, uh, from you know collecting that fee or something like that. Uh, the other thing is you want to make sure that you have a good contract with that person that articulates their responsibilities. One of those responsibilities should be to keep a really solid paper trail to make sure uh, that if there is a problem with the theft of the idea or a copyright infringement that you have the evidence you need in order to go into court and prove your case. But other than that, no, I wouldn't say uh, you shouldn't do this kind of a deal. Just make sure you're dealing with reputable people who actually have the right, uh, the, the ability, I should say, to, uh, to make something happen for you. And uh, in these situations, I would shy away from anything that gives those person, those people an exclusive right for any real length of time. A couple of months at a stretch, maybe, but uh, longer term deals would be uh, a bad idea because uh, that ties up your work uh, almost indefinitely.